Hello, this is Mari Elaine on the Buying Space channel. And today I'm doing an unboxing from Your Fabulous. Um, Your Fabulous is a channel that mainly does uh, jewelry. But on the uh, family reseller auction, Your decided <laughs> to break into... Um, thrift store merchandise, household goods, that sort of thing. And she uh, kind of went on the family um, reseller auction to um, as a project with her mother. So that um, since there were two people working together, <coughs> excuse me, and one was essentially in training. It did take longer to receive this order than it normally would from your fabulous, and that's okay. We all have different circumstances in our life, and we work around them. And as long as you keep that communication open with your customers, everything is fine. Oh, here we have a card. Buying space. Thank you. And it says thank you. Myra, thank you for your purchase. Most of all, thank you for your support, patience, and guidance to a new reseller like me. To new resellers like me. It's much appreciated. Enjoy your new stuff. You're fabulous. What a beautiful note. And there's also paper in here, which is a professionally printed invoice. See, it has my address on here, which is a post office box, and that's already on my about page. So I will show this wonderfully professional invoice list with your fabulous um, icon up here which I love that it's like an inner space uh, funnel for those of you into physics or graphic arts or um, optical illusions it's a wonderful icon okay and we have the party gift or the party uh, supply a lot. And a lot of this is uh, pink. And we, I'm going to open that a little later. More party supplies, balloons. They just threw in a couple extra. Her mom said she was going to add extra. So that's a piece of glass. More balloons. It's just like a party in the box. Oh my goodness. More ruffles. Oh, there's one more thing in here. Oh, 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 yes. I remember now. This is a great lot. Of course, um, <clears throat> the party lot was a lot, and these other items were purchased separately. So, um, I do want to open this to see more of what the, the party lot includes. I have a child who is non-binary so uh, these things that are rainbow colored are perfect see these are loot bags so I can put just white tissue paper on gifts and put them in this and I've got rainbow bags this is more loot bags that are clear so I could put wrap stuff in wrapping paper and put them in the bag <laughs> and I just have the perfect gifts for those more loot bags for this year latex balloons lots of balloons my goodness more balloons oh 
And here's the balloons that are falling all over the place but are great. Let me see. They say something, I think. Yeah, they say... Um, it's right in the fold on that one. They say happy birthday, and they have a little cake on them. I would blow them up, but I don't want anybody to know how bad my lungs are. And we have one of each of these, which is appropriate. <laughs> now, this and this go together, and I'm pretty excited about this. I didn't say anything in the chat, again, because sometimes I have knowledge of things, and sometimes I share them if I'm not going to purchase, but if it's about an item that I'm going to purchase, I've learned to keep quiet because I stir interest in the product. <laughs> and people bid against me after I'm the one that mentioned why it's valuable <laughs> or what's unique about it. So I decided I'm going to stop shooting myself in the foot and just keep quiet <laughs> if I'm going to bid on the item. Now, if I'm not going to be bidding on the item, um, I will be helpful to others that are might be interested. Because I like to go into a channel, especially an auction, and be helpful and help the uh, seller be successful. And if I'm going to buy, I'm doing that. If I'm not going to be buying and I know something, I can then say it. To absolutely positively be helpful to people. Don't necessarily do it at your own expense, though. This is packaged really, really well. And she did, she only used bubble wrap where it was necessary, which I like. Absolutely use shipping paper when you can. I had another reseller uh, last week that used uh, grocery bags, which I loved. Just loved. Okay. I like how she did this on the handle. Let me show you. She put paper through the loop. With, when you're shipping glass, dead space is uh will cause your item to break because when pressure is put against it the uh, space if there's empty space there is more likely to collapse so this is actually how you do this i've seen one more trick and i'll have a piece of cardboard to show you I have to make another video about how uh, to pack glass, but this is an excellent example. Now this is coffee latte, and it has all those words. You know how on Facebook there used to be this app that you could go, and it would put all the words together that you most commonly use. I have a group, group called Old Monday, or Monday, where we post mainly coffee memes. <laughs> And the um, wonderful thing about this that I noticed is it's a um, really good brand, but it says Greenbrier International, Royal Norfolk Greenbrier International, microwave and dishwasher safe. Now, Greenbrier is a wonderful resort in southern west virginia southeast virginia and west virginia and it is uh, it used to have an underground bunker uh, there for uh, people in dc that were escaping nuclear war <laughs> and uh it's still there they used to give tours for it i don't know if they do now i had a friend that was a tour guide there but i knew about the bunker long before most people in the public did because I was, well, my bachelor's degree is in um, 
criminal justice than I knew people. Anyway, uh, this is a wonderful vanilla caramel cream syrup to put in your coffee. And it's in date, so I can use that for my coffee. And that's a wonderful item. She sold that as a set. And this is something that many of people in our community are known for loving. I started to get a wider variety, a more abstract variety of this thing. I just ordered a necklace from somebody that had needlepoint on it and they didn't even know that it was an owl. <laughs> Everybody's like, oh, that's pretty needlepoint. But nobody recognized or said that it was an owl, even in the chat. And I'm like sitting there like that's one of the times I kept quiet. And then people realized that the uh, pattern actually formed kind of an abstract owl they would be bidding. So I just kept quiet. And my owl need a point necklace is on the way. Hopefully it'll get here before Marty's birthday. So here we go. This is a little bit more abstract but easily recognizable. And this is from Earthenware Dishwasher Microwave Safe made in China which a lot of our things are made in China. And this last item is something that is for me that I love. This is a smaller item. I've actually started buying smaller items. When I buy more space, I guess I'll get the 20-foot uh, version of this type of thing. <laughs> or at least the 18-inch to 24-inch version. But uh, as of right now, I'm collecting small items that are just as valuable as some of those larger items. Of course, if there was a 20-foot version, I think it would be worth more. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited. For any of you that are in the uh, right auctions with me or uh, have spent more than five minutes with me, really know that I love blue glass. Now this piece is not marked, but there is the evidence that this was hand blown and it's vintage. Okay. Have to be very careful. There is a small delicate feature at the top. Good. This tape must come off because I'm not ever going to get that feature shown without risking breaking it if the tape doesn't come off. See, she stuffed it. She stuffed paper inside so there was no dead space in the middle. And she wrapped paper around this really delicate handle. And then she wrapped the whole thing in paper and then she wrapped the whole thing in bubble wrap so that's excellent packing but this is a beautiful little delicate vase and it's hand blown and I just love the detail on that that glass blower has talent and this was not done in a mold this was completely hand blown uh, because you can't add 
this feature and it's very hard to have this ruffle in a mold. So when it's ruffled like this, this is unique. They try to follow, you know, a certain way that they do it. And someone very good, you know, makes copies that are different pieces that are very close to each other, but they're all slightly unique on this. So, um, and you can see kind of the ribbing. But I love this piece. And I, I love all the items I got from your fabulous. And um, we're going to have a party. I already have a few items, party items, that I already had from um, the last party we had in the house. But, uh, I was wondering about what I was gonna do about gift wrap because most of the gift wrapping I have is flowery stuff and uh, it's uh, kind of <laughs> uh, stuff that I can't use anymore but I could even use this piece of tissue paper and put in those rainbow gift bags and it'll all be good and so thank you so much your and thank you yours mom for packing this up and helping uh, with the auction uh, mom and uh, I'm just so happy. And this definitely is going to get used today. <laughs> There's no hesitation on that. And this will all be used next week. And this will go in my cabinet. And um, it's all good. <laughs> Thank you so much, Yor. Have a wonderful and blessed day, everyone.